Breaking news, a nine-year-old child was found living in a dog cage outside in freezing temperatures. The nine-year-old was discovered after an anonymous 911 call was placed by neighbors on October 19th. The caller also stated that her husband had taken food to the child previously in the cage and that this was an ongoing issue. When officers arrived, they said there was frost on the ground and the child had no shoes on, jeans and a t-shirt and was unable to speak to them. He was shivering so badly until they warmed him up. Once the child was warmed up and able to communicate, he told officers that he lived outside and did not have a room. While authorities were rescuing the child, the stepmother watched from the doorway, but then she went in the house and turned off all the lights. Once officers were able to enter the home, the stepmother told them that her aunt was the only one that knew the combination to the lock. The boy's father and stepmother say that they knew he was being held outside and they were quote upset about it, but reiterated the only one who knew the combination was the aunt. In addition to the child found outside, there was a four-year-old child found underneath her bed and two additional children ages seven and eight that were at school. All five children were taken into custody and were cleared medically. The stepmother, however, has been charged with seven counts of felony neglect, child abuse, inflicting serious mental and emotional injury, misdemeanor child abuse, and three counts of felony child abuse, of inflicting serious physical injury. The boy's father faces two counts of felony neglect, child abuse, inflicting serious mental and emotional injury, and felony child abuse, inflicting serious physical injury. The child's aunt is looking at two counts of possession of a firearm by a convicted felon, misdemeanor child abuse, assault of a child younger than 12, two counts of felony neglect, child abuse, inflicting serious mental and emotional injury. Injury. The child's father and stepmother's bonds are at $1 million and the aunt's bond remains at $300,000. I'll keep you guys updated as this develops. What do you think? Drop in the comments.